What's up guys, Yazan here. In my last videos, I shared a macro to use in the raid, U18 raid. But a lot of you guys has been asking me, hey, can I use like hell units? Yo, how can I do a macro to this specific raid, infinity, story mode, whatever. So in this video, I will be teaching you how to make your own macro. Today, we're gonna be using tiny task and the epic pen program is this, which you can write on your screen, as you can see. You write on your screen. You will be asking now, why do we need something like this? We need something like this, guys. You will see in a minute. It's so important to make your macro accurate. Okay? That's very important. Because if you miss one thing in macros in general, you're going to miss the whole farm. And probably you are AFKing throughout the night. And if something went wrong, your whole night will be cancelled with the farm. So you need to be so accurate in this. So that's why I use this epic pen. I will drop the links of tiny task and epic pen in the description so you go ahead download them then continue the video okay you can macro all raids okay the stuff you can actually macro in it it's raids story mode and infinity yes infinity you can go ahead and macro in infinity but for me to be honest on what if i tried raids is the best to afk you want levels it's in the raid you want jewels it's in the raid you want emeralds it's in the raid you want gold it's in the raid too and even this new token you can obtain it from the raids this one is basically anything you play but you can farm it too in the raid you can go ahead choose any raid you want maybe you want to farm for a specific unit maybe you want to get this unit so you go ahead and macro in this you know you maybe you want to do this maybe you want to get sanjin Wu. you can go ahead farm from flying island for luffy you need kaido too uh, you can go ahead farm for this like i said in the last video this one is the best for me because you have two units okay you can go ahead and sell these two units that's what i do and gain gold okay you have flower garden if you want this one to get kirito of course it have more jewels are the same but maybe the xp is more okay you have 3k xp as you can see oh, the xp got nerfed okay i just realized guys that they nerfed the xp because in the last video, the XP was 7k, something close. And now, if we go to the last story with Nightmare, you can see that it's 5k, 750. So if you are aiming for XP, and you, you can go ahead and micro in something that gives XP much more. So it's all up to you. But now, leveling up, it's much harder. Alright, so let's dive in. And I will explain you what to do and how to actually record a macro and use it okay all right so first basically you're gonna choose what you're gonna macro in so i'm a, i will go ahead with a raid i will save a macro for myself in a uh, let's say uh, the new raid okay i want to macro this i want to get this unit and macro this because it's the latest raid so this one okay so let's go ahead and select this one i will show you exactly what you need to do to make the perfect macro to use for you guys okay so first of all the game is gonna start i have the auto start on okay so you need to clear it once before you make the macro go ahead and clear it normally okay so let's put the units this step is gonna help you a lot you need to pick a point for you to macro in okay that's so important so for the first clear it's not important to be honest what to do all you need is to actually clear and find a spot and you need to put all of your units just put all of your units like i'm doing right now and you will figure out why i use this uh, epic pen because it's so helpful guys all right so let me get this ready so you're gonna go to this program which is the epic pen you're gonna go ahead and press on the pen okay and you're gonna see this one the auto upgrade button you're gonna go ahead and make a mark on this all of them you're gonna go ahead and make marks on them like this just to know where is the place of them and use them okay so all right so on the retry here we're gonna make a mark too as you can see guys we've made a mark now we can go ahead and retry just so the game doesn't kick us so as you can see guys we have one two three four five six seven eight nine and unit manager okay and the retry button so what you gonna do guys 
this is it you have done 90 percent of the macro the thing you want to do now is you're going to find you a spot that you will never forget because whenever you're going to use this macro you're going to be in the same spot it's either a spot that you're going to take with a record a screenshot or whatever the thing i will do for me to find a spot the most obvious spot i can be in is to come here and stay on this like this see this rock i will go on the look i will go on the so i will go on this angle then look all the way up okay so i have made my thing clear as you can see now you're gonna start tiny task so for tiny task here so what you're gonna do here is you're gonna go to settings recording hotkey personally i use f8 to record my macros so i will go ahead press on f8 then start recording macro and what I'm gonna do, focus with me guys, when I press F8, I'm gonna get with my mouse, do not press your numbers, do not use your numbers, use your mouse, what I'm gonna do guys, is you're gonna press here, okay, press here, one, two, three, three presses, okay, then you're gonna pick units from your farm units, it's better guys, pick your farm units, like put like this, one, okay, let's do like this, put it whenever you want, but don't put your units too close together, okay, so put one, then go ahead, put the other farm unit. Then go ahead, put your DPS unit. Go ahead and put your second DPS. Put this, put that, okay? Then you're gonna press on this one. Press on the marks we have put in here. You're gonna press once on every mark. Do not miss and press close and press F8 again. And like this, we have recorded a macro. It's so simple, guys. So I will go ahead and record a macro in front of you guys and use it, okay? That's to be so clear. So, like I said, F8, so you can start recording. Then do what I said quickly, okay? And we will have the macro ready. An important thing, guys. If you recorded your macro with your full screen on, you have to use your macro with full screen on. If you recorded your macro with uh, this window screen on, you're just gonna use it with you with your windowed screen on it's not gonna work we're gonna go ahead press f8 record retry okay so thing we're gonna do one two three four five six this boom 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 f8 that's it guys i recorded my macro okay after we could record my macro we're gonna press on save we, I'm gonna make, uh, uh, I don't know what is that, Valhalla, I guess it's the name of Valhalla, raid, Valhalla raid, like this, and I'm gonna go ahead and save that. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and play the macro. So, the most important thing, you're gonna go ahead and play the play speed on 100x, and you're gonna run the continuous playback. That's so important. So, we're gonna click on play right now. See? Everything is working. It's upgrading the units. And it's done. That's that's it guys. I've made a macro. Let's see if it's gonna retry or it's just gonna get me out. Okay, let's see. All right, we retried. That's it, guys, and it's working. So when you finish, you're gonna go ahead and press F8 again, okay? And don't forget to save your macro. So to save, you're gonna press on save, name the macro and use it. So I have this one, I have this one right now. So I have two macros. And whenever you wanna open it, you're gonna press on open, you're gonna choose your macro. Then you're gonna go to preferences, and you're gonna go ahead on continuous playback okay in the game actually what you do you need to change you're gonna make sure your seamless retry is on because if it's off it means that you're gonna go ahead and spawn right here okay? every single time to close this you can press on this close the tool power and that's it all right guys that's it for today's video i uh, hope it was helpful hope you guys understand me because 
I kind of talked a lot. I needed to explain. You have to understand me so you can do one on your own. It might sound a bit complicated, but it's not. Okay, hope the video was helpful, guys. Don't forget to drop a like and make sure you subscribe to my channel, guys. I'm going to post a lot of helpful videos in the future. I'm trying to work on them. You can ask me whatever you want in the comments, guys. Feel free to ask. See you in the next video.